Hi. Uh, my name is Lenore von Stein, and this is The Facts, uh, which is a series of, uh, it's a TV series. And I'm here tonight with uh, Bern Nix, uh, Beth Griffith, and Andrew Bolotowski. And this episode of The Facts is, uh, is a, it's, a, it's the third part of a mini-series within the series. It's called Vincenzo, and this is Vincenzo Part Three, The Conclusion. Uh, so this looks like a monster movie. And um, so, um, um, well, I, I, I'm trying to figure out what this thing is about. Why, well, he, you know, you know, we, we're, 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 we're most vulnerable to other people when we're children. And children are delicate creatures, and, and, and they know a lot, but and they don't do much second guessing, even though they go along with the crowd. Um, and their sophistication uh, is, is, is muted by limited experience and by their, they're either very vulnerable and by their, you know, pragmatic defense policies. Um, this Vincenzo story, this triptych, I call it a triptych, it's three parts. It's sort of like, you know, those things you see on the, somebody's dressing table, one and two sides. But anyway, this, um, this story revolves around uh, feelings and circumstances and events that interweave, and, and that is the story. <laughs>
When I was a kid, I, I rarely saw uh, a moment on TV that made me laugh. I watch TV all the time. I still watch TV all the time. But, but uh, now I, I, I laugh often when I watch the TV. And, and so, so, so am I uh, feeling better? Or am I adjusting? Uh, or um, what's the third choice? I had a third choice written down here. Or am I getting the subtleties? Over this period that I've been alive, I've developed more space inside of me for me. Um, in some ways, I am becoming very young, or maybe uh, pre-verbal. It's a very vulnerable time for, for us when we, before we can speak because we can't express the things that are happening as too well, at least with, with much, you know, shading. So if bad things happen. Thank you. 
Allowing someone to express themselves, you know, and, and especially, let's say it's something that they've spent a lot of time preparing, like a piece of art, you know, that expression, and allowing that artwork to enter your nervous system, to, to, to let it in, go on that ride, you know, and, and, and uh, without, without worrying about obeying it or, or, or what does it mean or something, Not, don't, don't care, confident enough to, to let it in. And... Um, you know, you look at a painting, and, and it's hard. It's hard. It's hard to get my eyes to relax and my ears to relax and let it, let it give you, you know, whatever ride it's going to give you. And, 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 and you know, you, you, like taking the opportunity to look at something, a painting or something, like you would a tree. You know, the tree the tree's just there. The tree doesn't ask you to obey it. The tree doesn't, it's not be foolish if you like the tree or hate the tree or, you know, it's...
laid out there um, in some way. Um, when I was a kid, I liked to go to the I liked to go to the movies by myself. I imagine there are many people like that. I because then I didn't have to talk to people about what I thought about the movie or anything. And then you know I could just be alone, uh, lost in this experience, you know. And um, and I I've, I've spent a lot of my life alone with my experiences and uh, and. I, I, you know, th then at least I don't have to explain myself or listen to perceptions or, 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 s or speak about what I'm thinking to disinterested, perhaps skeptical listeners, and um, even though it's not enough stimulation. Either I could have said yes, cause that was a, a beautiful ring. Ah, no ma, said I, don't know what, what I feel. feel. I'm so passionate I to some, so some for those who This Vincenzo story covers up um, why I'm so stupid <laughs> and um, I'm so lame, and 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 when I wisen up, uh, why it gets me so little, uh, and uh, you know, little steps. Telling this story um, might get me bigger steps, you know, but is it possible?
Vincenzo's story is about finding yourself, my mother used to talk about herself in the third person, drove me nuts, finding yourself once more in, a, in an unsettling, uh, fractured kind of place because you're dealing with somebody who is not really trustworthy, who doesn't really, you know, is not really friendly towards you. And, and, and this, is, this is mother's mil milk to me, except it's not really, it's, it's, it's a tortured version of, it's not uh, mother's milk. Um, it's a it's a it's a simplified
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1.